All new at 10 kids in Beaumont schools will begin walking through metal detectors before heading to the classrooms. The school board passed a budget item tonight to pay for the detectors and some other security measures. 12 News reporter Cameron Seibert joins us tonight with which schools are on that list and Cam, what prompted the change? Yeah, Dej, well, all seven board members in attendance for the meeting tonight voted in favor of new security measures. The board members say the overall goal is to keep students safe. Tonight's Beaumont Independent School District board meeting had some important topics and updates, but security was top of mind. I think that they need to do whatever it is necessary to protect the children. Camille Davis says her child doesn't always feel completely safe at school and that it's a product of the world we live in. You know, I don't remember being in high school and being afraid to go to school or, or even worry about if somebody's bringing something to school. Tonight, she can have more peace of mind. The BISD board unanimously passed a $155,000 proposal to add security cameras to six schools and acquire 26 metal detectors and handheld scanners. It, it has always been necessary. Uh, we, we started a couple years ago at, at the stadium out there. It's not that uh, we are any worse, any better than anybody else. Board President Robert Dunn says it's a move BISD needed to make. I'm just happy that we're getting them. It's, it's about time. A lot of other districts have them already. So it, it's about time that BISD got them. During a pilot program where detectors were used last year at Westbrook High, officials say the only downside was a delay for students coming in. Uh, and of course that was roughly between a 15, 20 minute or so uh, delay. Uh, we anticipated that. BISD Police Chief Joseph Marlboro says the detectors are another tool in their arsenal to keep kids safe. Dunn agrees and hopes parents will feel the same way too. They should feel that we are doing the best we can to keep their babies safe. It's also important to note that the metal detectors will only go into effect at secondary schools, that's middle schools and high schools. A timeline for the changes was not talked about at tonight's meeting. But I'm live in Beaumont, Cameron Seibert, 12 News.